Hello folks, from the looks of it, generative AI is going to define next year's flagship phones. Samsung has already confirmed that its 2024 phones will offer generative AI features. The South Korean giant said that AI in Galaxy devices will bring new experiences to users and they are planning to offer this in 2024. The technology that Samsung is referring to is the use of an on-device generative AI technology that will work without the need to connect to the internet, meaning that generative AI is similar to ChatGPT will be implemented on Samsung Galaxy phones, which will allow users to access various services through simple commands without the internet. However, a new rumor suggests that the company might offer these features as part of a subscription service. The technology that will bring generative AI features to the Galaxy S24 has already seen the light of the day. Qualcomm unveiled the Snapdragon Agent 3 chipset last month. It will power a whole host of on-device AI features on Snapdragon variants of the Galaxy S24 series. Samsung's Exynos 2400 chipset for the Galaxy S24 is also said to heavily focus on generative AI. According to an unsubstantiated rumor on X, Samsung is actively pursuing the idea of providing on-device AI features of the Galaxy S24 through a subscription service. Precisely what form the subscription service could take remains to be seen, but of all the subscription-based services that the company could launch, this would be the most counterproductive. There is no other evidence to support this rumor right now, so it's entirely possible that this doesn't amount to anything more than just a rumor. It's hard to imagine that other manufacturers would charge for on-device generative AI features, particularly when this technology isn't popular and you need to give the average user some time to understand what this tech can do for them. Putting it behind a paywall on day one will make sure that most of them don't even bother to try it out. Although Samsung has been working with AMD over the past few years to bring ray tracing features to its Exynos chips, the company seems to be working on its own version of ray tracing and AI-powered upsampling technologies for future Exynos processors. This news comes just a few days after it was revealed that Samsung is working with AMD and Qualcomm to bring FSR to its phones. A team at Samsung Advanced Institute of Technology seems to be working on two new technologies, Neural Ray Reconstruction and Neural Super Sampling. According to Daily Korea, these technologies will reportedly be brought to Exynos chips after 2025. If this report is accurate, these gaming technologies might not be included in Samsung's 3 nanometers Dream chip developed for the Galaxy S25 series. Samsung's ray tracing is claimed to be superior to AMD's and Nvidia's as it offers ray tracing to all parts of a scene. In comparison, AMD and Nvidia's ray tracing is usually only applied to some parts of a game's frame where light is reflected. As ray tracing needs a lot of process and power, Samsung uses NPU for ray tracing related calculations and an AI powered super sampling method. Like AMD's FSR and Nvidia's DLSS, it can render frames at a lower resolution and upscale them to a high resolution to reduce the burden on the chipset. After this, anti-aliasing is applied to smoothen the edges of objects in a video frame. Since there has been no official announcement about these technologies, take this information with a pinch of salt. But anyway guys, I will keep you updated, so subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, see you in the next one. Good luck to all.